Good morning guys, it is Tuesday today, it doesn't be like it. We got up quite early this morning. Yeah, well we were awake from seven, well actually a little bit before that, wasn't it? Because my Which, alarm went off at like course to seven. That's right, yeah, for, for a lot of people who like do office jobs, that's like not even early at all. But uh, we've been like really slacking lately and getting up like super late. Yeah. Like gone 10. So well, well, I think we got ourselves into like almost like a nocturnal sleeping pattern. So we were, we'd be like up until, or like awake until late. Can you, Lily? Yeah, I'll come to it. You can. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, we were like st staying up until like half one, two kind of thing. And then obviously getting up later, which uh, I mean, for us working from home, that is. Like, that's still fine, because we were getting everything that we needed to do done. But we just wanted to get back on, like, a normal, like, what everyone else would do. Yes, so, we got up, we done a workout before 9 o'clock, and then we popped down to the bay. I've got myself a coffee, um, and we got, like, little bits of shopping that we needed, and we're back by 11 o'clock. So, feeling very productive so far. So, I'm going to film a makeup tutorial today. So, I posted on Instagram yesterday. Um, I was just like playing around with some of my makeup and I did like a like teal and orange eye and it looked really cool. It's not like an everyday look. It's not something that I would like rock on a daily basis, but it's like cool, funky and I want to try and get more into colour this year. So I am going to start getting myself ready to film that. So I'm going to try and do something with the old hair because it got wet outside and it's gone a bit bleh. Um, And yeah, what I'll probably do is do like my one eye and most of my base so that it's not like a super long video. Do you guys prefer shorter makeup tutorials or like long makeup tutorials because I did used to do them quite long and now I've like really you know kind of like stripped it back so that they're much shorter but let me know what you think you can tell I've had some coffee already I'm like <laughs> I'm all all over the place I'm pumped do you want to come out Miss Lily? I think she does. We still have our Christmas tree up and it is, what's the date? 9th? 9th of Jan. I wasn't going to tell them. Oh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yes, it is still up. Uh, I don't know, it's just... Well, no, to be fair, because like there was a lot of stuff going on at the, at the beginning of December. So I didn't get my full like like run of the Christmas tree. I turned the lights off anyway. So... It's not quite as bad. Um, it will get taken down, I promise. But yeah, so I'm gonna start getting myself ready to film and then I will edit that. I've got an ASOS parcel. Oh, it's Gareth again that's coming. Yeah. Yeah. G-Man. Gaza. Um, and yeah, see, because whenever it's Gareth, my like delivery guy, we're tight. Um, he always messages telling me exactly when, like within like an hour slot, when um, he's going to turn up. Some of the others that, that come, they don't tell you, so Gareth's the man. Um, but yeah, so I've got a cheeky little ASOS delivery coming. Again, it was stuff that was in the sale, so... I'm looking forward to that. I will show you later on when it arrives. And then we are going on date night tonight. Date night. We haven't been on date night for ages now. Um, so we're going to Ask Italian in town, which should be good because we do like Italian. And hopefully they do some nice salads because I am all on the salad train. How many salads have I had within like the past week. Right, it's been pretty much salad for like lunch and dinner, tea, whatever you want to call it. I decided to mix it up today and I'm going to have some tomato soup 
for my lunch because I thought maybe it's getting a bit excessive. Although to be true and honest, I did fancy a salad and I was gonna get one, but I thought let's, let's mix it up a bit. Anyway, I'm babbly now, I've had a bit of coffee. I am gonna crack on and I will see you guys in a bit. Joe has some exciting news. You can now upload backgrounds to episodelife.com directly. Ooh. You don't need to email me anymore. Uh, so yeah, huge news for the website. It's gonna be hopefully like a really kind of like thriving community because uh, it's not just uploading backgrounds. Like you can like chat amongst yourselves. You can promote your own stories there, and you can like get direct and help and tips from each other. So uh, be a nice little family. It should be. It should be. I'm looking forward to seeing how how the community grows. So you worked hard on that and. Um... It all looked very complicated to me. Hmm. It was like super smart. He was doing coding and stuff last night in bed. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it's been something I've been wanting to do for a while because, like, I can only, like, post so much each day. But I love the idea of, like, having, like, a site where you can all just, like, contribute your own stuff. And it doesn't even have to go through me as, like, a middleman. You just directly, like, post your stuff and everyone can uh, see it and interact. So, yeah, I think it should be, uh, should be fun. Episodelife.com Episodelife.com oh, So I have just finished filming now. It takes ages. I forgot how long it takes to film a tutorial, but film the makeup look and I am absolutely starving so I'm going to A. Drink some more of my coffee um, B. Have some soup because I am starving stuff and stuff and then I'm gonna edit the makeup tutorial then and then take this makeup off because I feel like it's a bit cray for going on date night so take off this makeup shower and everything and then reapply some makeup so busy 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 hello guys so today well I say today this afternoon has been a little bit of a rush uh, but I managed to film my tutorial I edited it edit I edited, I edited, yeah, I edited it <laughs> and now I've quickly rushed to get ready again um, I ended up just taking off my eye makeup and then just reapplying the lashes so this looks a bit more natch um, yeah this is the jacket that I got from ASOS it was a new look one but anyway it's just like a kind of fake suede biker jacket in like a nice tan colour which I've wanted for years now, so I got that and I'm happy with it. It's a nice, like, tight fitting one, so um, yeah, we are just about to get a bus into town now so we can go for our meal, our date night. So, yeah, we are literally just about to head off and do that right now. Well guys, we're back from that meal now and as much as we loved date nights, that food was revolting. Like we're very grateful to Jess for uh, getting us those vouchers. It was a lovely Christmas gift, but uh, flipping hell, I ask Italian, you need to sort your act out because that was absolutely disgusting food. I don't even know where to start. I mean, we had some kind of like bread with olive tapenade on it to begin with and the olive tapenade was like... I don't know, it was like rotten or something. And Charlotte had a chicken Caesar salad. I said it was the worst chicken Caesar salad she's ever had in her life. And she eats a lot of chicken Caesar salads. Um, it looked disgusting. Like the chicken looked, you can just tell when like chicken is like previously frozen. Like there's no excuse for a restaurant not to just serve fresh chicken, you know. And uh, apart from being uh, frozen previously, it also looked like it was one of those chicken breasts that had been pumped with water in a factory. Uh, you can just tell, like if you eat chicken, you can tell when a chicken breast has been pumped with water to begin with, to make to bulk it out, to make it cheaper uh, to sell to restaurants and stuff. So they're obviously buying the cheapest, cheapest, nastiest chicken possible. And to be honest, it's just disgusting. I, I, I'm, I'm really disappointed in the restaurants. So ask Italian, shame on you. But we did have a lovely uh, date night despite the disgusting food. 
So uh, it was nice because we haven't been uh, out for a restaurant meal since uh, winter bath at the beginning of December. So that was really cool. And we've got a lot more restaurant dates coming up soon because it's Charlotte's birthday soon. And then our anniversary of our first date. It's going to be 11 years since we've been together. And uh, for Charlotte's birthday, we're going to Strada, which we know we love. So Strada is always good. We've been there loads of times. And then we're going to try a place called the Bayside Brasserie for our anniversary. And then we're going to be going to Nando's for like a family meal uh, for Charlotte's birthday with, with our family. So um, we know we love Nando's. Nando's is a staple of ours. So anyway, guys, uh, that is it for tonight. Charlotte is currently trying to wrestle her fake nails from the cat, Lily, because Lily has been eating them. And I think she's missing four nails. So, uh, yeah. Did you find your nails? Nope. No, I did not. So, who knows where they've gone? Into Look at her. Lillian's belly. Have you eaten those nails, Lil? Lily, do you Oh, you know she has. It you just know it. They were there. That, that looks like a guilty face to me. I was just telling everyone how disgusting the meal was. Yeah, that was not... Like, I, I don't like to be negative. <laughs> about places but yeah that, that was pretty shoddy food but the company was great yeah i agree, I agree. morning guys we are just heading to the train station now because we're going to go to lamb braddock and see joe's lamb and we got up early and did a workout this yeah, morning we've done a workout already we are being very productive we are on the workout train workout workout <laughs> the workout train <laughs> People um, be bapping us and waiting the camera. Know, yeah. this, this happened in Land Bradley before. Yeah. Basically, I, I, I think, think they're not used to <laughs> we're so We're so out into the valleys that like people just are not used to seeing cameras on people. Um, yeah, when we get back to Cardiff, talking of cameras, we're going to have a little look. Oh yeah. Because I'm in the market for a new vlog camera. Yeah, we're thinking of getting a uh, G7X or a G5X yeah. Canon because um, this... Uh, this is a 70D, this is like a huge, big, heavy thing with like a microphone on the top, which looks really like obvious. Um, but one of those little G7Xs. Nice and discreet. Yeah, just looks like a little stills camera then, you know. Really? Every time there's a box around, there is a cat in it. Hey guys, so we are back home now. Um, yeah, I got very, very confused earlier on. <laughs> so when I was saying about looking at cameras, for some reason I thought that we were going to look in town, but we're actually going to look online instead because the one that I'm interested in um, isn't actually in store, in town. I, I can only say that I'm tired. <laughs> that is my only defence. Um, yeah, so we are back now and the tree is finally coming down. <laughs> Goodbye What's tree. The today? The 10th. So we're a little bit late. Not too bad though. I think it's earlier than last year. I think we kept it up like nearly the whole of Jan. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's not, the tree's not going anywhere if Lil's in the box. Like. What are you doing? What are you doing, Bubba? She's like, are you, she's breaking the box apart. Oh my gosh. She's got a hand like underneath. Oh, Lil. Oh, Lil. What are you doing? Oh. Okay, well. Oh, she's, oh, she's set all down now. She's laying there. Well, the tree ain't going anywhere then. I am actually going to start editing this vlog now. Oh, my skin looks super shiny and greasy. Wow. Honestly, I don't think I've ever looked better. Yeah, I'm going to start editing this vlog now. Um, I would do it tomorrow, 
but I want to try and take a little bit of a day off tomorrow because you show the boxes. It's so exciting. Look at all these. These are going on my laptop. I have been without The Sims for a very, very, very long time. And I think I might have said during Vlogmas that I was probably going to wait until January before I installed them all on my laptop because there was so much going on. I didn't need a distraction like The Sims. But now it is January. So tomorrow I am going to install all of those on my laptop. So I thought... If I can get the editing done today, then I don't have to worry about it tomorrow. Tula. Tula. Oh, no, 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 that's a light. Tula. <gasps> Tula. No, 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 no. Oh, my God. Just chewing the Christmas lights. Can we not? Because we still want to use them. Next year. Come here. Come to a mother. Uh, where was I? Anyway, I'm tired. But I am going to persevere and edit because it's for the greater good of The Sims. But Joe is just taking the tree down and watching. Yeah, I've been watching uh, Gabriella Scurry from 4Kids Gaming. Uh, she's been doing a playthrough of The Ember Effect. She's played through some other stories as well. She's played through Secret of the Rain and The Last Goodbye. And uh, she's so animated. It's just really fun watching her reactions. Especially like, because I know what's coming up in, in the story. Yeah. And it's like, I like to do things that's going to like, shock people twist wise and uh, yeah it's, it's a lot of fun just seeing her kind of scream at uh, certain things that are mm -hmm. happening so uh, yeah check out the channel for kids gaming i will some point soon i am gonna book myself in to get a new tattoo and i had a tattoo now for years when was the last time i had a tattoo oh, i think no. Because like I know I did have um, my the one on my finger was like it was redone like it was gone over again because it wasn't quite right the first time but as in like a new tattoo it's been after years now so oh I'm torn whether to tell you or whether to keep it a secret and then vlog it and veil it hmm. but hopefully that will happen in the next month or so depends what slots they have available um hello lil oh do you want to go back inside the box and you can't because your sister's in there a shame thank you guys for watching we hope that you enjoyed this vlog and we will see you in the next one bye i have got rubber gloves on because these like tree branches are sharp <laughs> i'm just gonna protect my fingers from the uh, spikes there guys Thank you.